Good morning, Cougars. It is March 1st, and it's hopefully going to get warm soon, but not next week, so just bu keep bundled up. Hopefully we'll get, uh, we'll get to spring someday. But we're through February, and uh, we're in school. And, and welcome to your first long Friday in a very long time. I hope you enjoy every minute of it. Uh, the WPA is tonight, of course. Uh, tickets are on sale during lunch and also after school uh, in Mr. Benedict's room, 164. Plus, they are for sale at the door. They are $5.00. Remember, uh, you need to have your photo ID. Um, everybody has to have some sort of photo, photo ID. Uh, no book bags, uh, no bags except for small purses, and any bag that's brought in is subject to search. Uh, and also, uh, just make sure you read the dance rules that are on page 37 of the handbook. Make sure you're aware of them. Obviously, uh, nothing illegal and obviously nothing you can't do in school is acceptable to dance. Uh, so let's have a nice, safe, fun dance tonight. Let's have a good time. Uh, and not have any issues. It is going to be very cold tonight, so the, I doubt very much that the outdoor area will be open. Uh, so uh, again, be prepared for that. And um, there you go. And, all right, I think that's all I gotta say about that. Hey, today is a uh, special day. It is Speech and Debate Education Day nationally. Uh, the U.S. Senate proclaimed that. Uh, and so I just wanna give a shout out to our speech team uh, who did win a banner uh, this year at Allstate Large Group. Or Reader's Theater, and uh, just all around awesome kids, an awesome job that they do over there at the speech team, and then over at the debate team too, uh, qualifying, I believe, they've qualified seven students to nationals this year, uh, so good luck to our students that are going to nationals for debate, and uh, just, uh, you know, these are two activities that are really important to me, uh, I really do love them, uh, and uh, it's a great opportunity for you, so next year, if you're thinking about what am I going to do with myself, consider speech and debate, they're both really great teams that you can be a member of. Hey, next week also, uh, speaking of a great group, uh, Best Buddies will be celebrating Inclusion Week. Uh, there'll be opportunities for you to uh, celebrate inclusion and uh, making uh, time to be with everybody and spend time with everybody and, and to include everyone in what we do. Uh, there'll be a lot of uh, different things going on in the foyer, so check those out. And uh, we'll be celebrating uh, inclusion because it is important to include everyone in what we do. Uh, speaking of which as well, it is time to get registered for AP exams. That includes you. Everyone needs to get reg registered for their AP exams. Uh, because of all of the we winter weather and all of the delays and all the errors and, and whatnot that's gone on this month, uh, we're going to extend the registration deadline for AP exams to next Friday. So if you're in an AP class, talk to your AP teacher if you've not registered yet. Uh, and you do need to register online, aptestservice.com slash crcsd. And uh, remember, free and reduced lunch students, you do not pay for your exams, so get registered for those. And if you are not free and reduced lunch uh, student, but you do have uh, some financial barriers to paying for exams, please see Ms. Ritchie in 120 or see me in the main office. We will help you make those exams happen. All girls going out for tennis this year need to stop by and see Coach Benedict by Monday in room 164. You need to pick up information reg regarding tennis uniforms, sweats, etc. The w ordering window will be open for one week, so stop in soon. You may stop in before or after school or during smart time. Any girls interested in playing golf this spring need to come to an informational parent meeting Monday, March 4th, 6 p.m. in room 263. That's Coach Bierman's room. All players should bring along uh, with, the, should be there along with one parent. Any questions, see Coach Bierman. Attention seniors who are planning to, on going directly into the workforce following high school. Stop by counseling to register for the Future Ready Career Fair. Well over 50 employers will be on hand to talk to you about career opportunities. Bring a resume. The event is March 28th from, from 10 to 12 at the Lynn Regional Center on Boyson Road. Stop by counseling for more information and to register. And there's a whole bunch of scholarships that are available for seniors, many of which are due very shortly. There's $500 scholarship from the Optimus Club, a CR uh, Area uh, Association of Realtors has a $500 scholarship. The American Legion has two scholarships. One's $1,000, one's $1,500. And there's a variety of other uh, scholarships from empowering scholarships. So stop by Ms. Ritchie's office if you would like free money to college. And this is something that I cannot stress enough you should get. Look up, look down, and look all around. The school-wide Where's Waldo hunt has begun. When you find Waldo, return him to Miss Howard in room 101 to collect a prize. And Waldo is there to remind you that it is important for you to submit your writing and your art to the literary magazine, The Plain Brown Rapper, pbwsubmissions at gmail.com. Attention artists, the district art show is fast approaching. This year's theme is fantasy and mythology. And so you can bring your artwork to room 301 or 302 by March 10th. And also, all three, uh, 
all 2D and 3D submissions will be considered, and no one has, no matter what art classes you may or may not be in, you can bring anything and you want. Art uh, show will be held at Ray Gun downtown, uh, downtown Cedar Rapids on Saturday, March 30th. There will be a girls' soccer player meeting next Wednesday, the 6th, in the cafeteria, right at 5.30. And Art After Hours will have a session next Wednesday, right after school in room 301. Join us for that. Uh, as well, scholarships for the Herkelman Alumni Scholarship. See Mr. Benedict from room 164. And juniors and seniors are invited to Broke, Busted, and Disgusted. It's a film about student loans. March 6, 6.30 in the Ballantyne Auditorium at Kirkwood Community College. Birthdays today. We got a lot of them for the weekend, so hold tight. Here we go. Ready? Happy birthday to Benjamin Head, Lisette High, Aziza Labosha, and Rebecca Warfield for Saturday. Uh, Jillian Glessner, Joseph McAllister, Osvaldo Mejamantes, Benjamin Noring, uh, Jacob Civil Civils, Henry Sopp, and Gunnar Womry. Sunday, happy birthday to Caitlin Goldsberry, Alyssa Gray, Lauren Gray, Alexis Hockaday, Brecklin Keller, Christian Kronfeld, uh, Sophia Cisneros, Wiley Sullivan, and Akoya West. Happy birthday to all of you. It's a lot of birthdays. Activities for today, of course, we've got the WPA tonight. And the band carnival is today after school, so good luck to that. Have fun at the band carnival. I say combine the two. Go to the band car carnival first, then go to WPA. You can't go wrong with that. Uh, remember, too, uh, we celebrated yesterday. Our academic decathlon team is headed to uh, state this weekend, so good luck to them as they compete at the state competition. We're uh, hoping for a trip to nationals for them as well. Let's see if they can pull that off. And tomorrow, uh, we've got happiness at Jefferson. So come on out and celebrate show choir at Jefferson High School tomorrow. Uh, that's the last show choir competition of the season. Also, we've got Honors Orchestra tomorrow and the Honor Jazz Band. So we've got a lot of musical stuff going on as well. Good luck to everyone in those uh, shows and competitions. Lunch menu for today, Walking Tacos is at Station 1 and 2. Station 3 is Salad Subs, Parfaits, Hot Dogs and Fish. Station 4 is Pepperoni or Cheese Pizza with a fish sandwich or a fish sandwich. So you got fish sandwich there too. Station five is chicken alfredo with rotini, garlic, breadstick, and broccoli is the vegetable. Cougars, I hope you have a great weekend. I hope you have a great day today. Let's have fun at the dance tonight and uh, treat each other with kindness and respect as we enter into inclusion re week. It's important stuff to do and it's, it makes you feel better, makes everyone feel better. As always, go Cougs. Hi, my name is Sadie and I am the Best Buddies chapter and this is my buddy Laren. Hi. <laughs> Hi, I'm Ella and I'm the chapter's vice president and this is my buddy Ellie. <laughs> Kennedy is a unified champion school with our inclusive activities in the Best Buddies and Special Olympic program. Next week, March 4th through 8th is Respect Week. <laughs> this year's theme is Revolution is wait. Inclusion. Hashtag choose to include. Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, we will have opportunities for all of you to complete cougar paws in the foyer about what you think respect is for a piece of candy. We will be selling the JFK Cougar Choose to Include wristbands for a dollar. Thursday, we will ask that you can all wear red on that day to make sure to, to sign the pledge for respect in the foyer on our banner. We will also offer we will also offer a kindness tip on the announcement each day to promote respect. Thanks for all of your support on the inclusion. Go, Go Cougars! Cougars! <laughs>